the tip is off to Kane Dukes. Yeah, that was a great job there for the senior from Fishers, Indiana, and how nice to have a homecoming here of some sorts at Mackey Arena getting her first points of the game. Purdue miss, able to get the rebound. Abby Ellis, three ball goes. Ellis shot fake, Euro step inside. And the Aussies, even though she's from the land down under, gets the Euro to work. See, somebody that we were really looking at coming off the bench, senior Precious, Precious Johnson. Johnson number 31 there. Nice three there from McConnell. As there's Precious Johnson playing some defense and a nice takeaway by Duquesne. Now pushing the tempo, it's Kiaku. Had a, a decent season. It was a heartbreaker them losing in the A-10 championship game. Or, I mean, this is an NCAA tournament team. And a nice transition bucket. Quarterback Janae Terry turns. Post hook no good. And this Duquesne defense is tough. Yeah, Townsend with some defense of her own on that other end, and then it sets up something like that. You can see why she is the heart of this Dukes team. The Duchess of the Dukes, some might even say. Take to the inside, no good. Mary Ashley Stevenson with her own rebound. Did not travel and gets it to go with the left hand. Baseline drive from Jayla Smith. Nice pass to Elena Harper. And Duquesne is having buckets be hard to come by. Drive to the inside. Reverse layup for Abby Ellis. Switches hands. Drive inside. Kiaku kicks it out. Moving around. And McConnell's three falls. And Mary Ashley Stevenson pulls down yet another rebound. Her sixth of the game. Sophie Swanson, three ball falls. Take to the inside in nice defense played, but it doesn't matter. Great second chance effort for Duquesne. What an incredible shot there by Bernard, ducking under the defense of Abby Ellis. I mean, Ellis was all up in her face and not allowing for any breathing room, and Bernard was able to just flick it up there. Yeah, Smith also adding three rebounds as well, and you see a block there as she was able to cut the space. And She said, well, more like fear. They'd always play us close in here. They've got such a good atmosphere, and it's something she's definitely being mindful of as that's a nice three that goes down. Bucket no good there. Duquesne bringing it back within nine, and Purdue takes it right away. Yeah, Jayla Smith again on the defensive end and able to finish it off there with the reverse layup. Mid-range jumper, no good. Ellis pulls it down, and she has been a rebounding machine. Yeah, Abby Ellis with her sixth rebound of the evening. I mean, we're under three minutes here in the third quarter, and... Swanson leaves it short. Nice rebound and great effort. Second chance there from Hamilton and Duquesne. Yeah, the Dukes are in much need of possessions earlier this week that it was it felt good to get the opportunity coming off the bench not the playing time that she'd been looking for this season but a nice job there on a drive and one quick changes there getting getting his team on the floor that he would like and that's a nice bucket from Shonda Jones to extend the lead to 10. Yeah Journey Kiaku continue getting her the ball and letting her just go to the basket Smith, three ball goes. Nice rebound by Johnson, second effort, no good. Janae Terry pulls down the rebound. Now in transition, it's Jayla Smith with the layup. Movement around the outside. Duquesne may have gotten away with the travel there, but they capitalize with the three ball. Reynolds with the cross screen, ball goes to Reynolds. Three ball fired up and good. Baseline drive, kick over Monson. Three ball, no good. But Purdue pulls down the rebound. Over to Swanson, three ball and it goes. After making the super 16 of the WNIT tournament. As for Purdue, they're feeling great. A feeling only eight teams will have.